Welcome back to the Random Review Show. Yeah, the eyes were a little weird that time. So, this time, I'm not going to say this day, because it's all the last two videos, plus this one has been the same day. Um, so today is, see, I did it right now. I am going to review, and there's no drum roll, sorry. <laughs> Pushing Daisies, all right. Pushing Daisies is a great show. Um, it's canceled after two seasons. I thought it was an awesome show about a man who can touch dead objects and bring them back to life, ever so briefly. Now, because there's a minute rule on how long something can stay alive without messing up the balance of death. So. If he touches a human, and after a minute, if he doesn't touch someone else, or if he doesn't touch the human again, someone else in the immediate vicinity would die. Uh, so, this thing is something he found out when he was very, very young. When his mother died, and she, he touches her, his mom. And within a minute, his best friend's dad dies across the street. Um, I mean, the first time he figured this out was when he touched his dead dog, brought it back to life. So, after his mom dies, his dad sends him to boarding school. Okay, or he gets sent to boarding school. So, there he's kind of an outcast and somewhat weird so after doing that he learns how to cook and he becomes the pie maker now the pie maker teams up with uh, a detective yep it's one of those shows it's a detective show but it is real cool and I suggest anyone who likes some cool stuff and little funny humor, more dry humor than anything I think, would like it. Um, so they have this deal where he touches the dead person for a minute, get all the information, get who killed them, and then collect the reward money for the murder. All right, um, this seems to be going well until his best friend from childhood, Charles Charles, who she, not him, but she dies on a cruise and they want to know who killed her because it's a big publicity money thing. There's like reward to find out who killed her and everything. So, he resurrects her and gets enticed in conversation and, <laughs> and feelings that he forgets to touch her. And the Paul, or the, and the, I'm going to get this right, and and the mortician dies, that's what it is. So, now he can't touch her, otherwise she dies. And they start to have a thing for each other. It's like uh, a love story where they can't touch each other ever otherwise they die so they find ways around it now it's like I said it's a pretty good movie or it's a pretty good show I don't know why I want to call these things movies but they're pretty good it's pretty good and I suggest you watch it bye